This battle progression thing is weird as... Wait, we can see how much we'll get from a Pippet battle. Ooh, that'll be interesting. Okay, now that we've done that, we can finally go and attack Picket. Picket. Yes, that's his name. Anyways, it seems like that one person monster gap battle gave us an additional 10%. I do not know what's up with that. Maybe the previous battle had Let's just battle Pippet over here and see what's up. Pippet? Hello? Oh, uh oh, okay. Ah, uh, yes, yes, it's Pippet's usual dialogue. And now, what happens after we battle is. This battle progression thing is weird as can be. Anyways, let's battle. Ah, I wonder how much health Pippet has. Like, it's not stayed, but over here, so far, it's at least 48,000. Hmm, interesting. Okay, now Pippet's health should be about 9,600. Okay, intriguing. Mr. Editor, will you please display that on screen? Thank you very much. So that's the total combined damage. I feel like we'll need to deal approximately 20k damage, so two more attacks to finish off Pippet. Or maybe one more attack to finish off Pippet. I think one attack which you need to do to kill Pippet. Hopefully this is worth like to another 20%, you know? It would be nice. Okay, yeah, it seems like Pippet has approximately 20,000 health. Once you've won the battle, what you'll see is you'll collect yourself 21 battle stars, which is a lot more than the usual amount. And if you open the chest, you'll see that you get yourselves how many snowflakes? Just one? Okay, yeah, you get yourself one magical snowflake, and well, this pot comes up. And it seems like that every battle you're doing is e Okay, for some reason, every battle I'm doing is giving me 30% progress. Pippets, battling Pippets, and the monster just put me over here at 30%. Okay, so it seems like that we're gaining everything at 10% speed, which is interesting, I guess. Let's see what happens if we do a two-person monster battle. Maybe we'll get 20% of everything. And